Hola, 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 and welcome back to the kingdom. Guys, check this out, man. We are preaching and we're back to be... Whoa, what just happened? What did it go? Preaching. Look at this mono black right here, man. Oh my god, guys, I've been having fun with this deck a lot just because it's got my favorite color mono black. But before we jump in, guys, thank you so much for all the love and the support you guys drop in the channel. I know, I've been gone for a while, guys, but trust me. It's just the life right now, okay? It's the peak season and work had become very, very crazy. And all I want to do is just come home and get some rest because the next day I got to be up at five. But today I was off and I wanted to bring you guys some of the decks that I've been playing here and there. And it's going to be preaching. So Preacher of the Schism, whatever you say that thing, this guy is amazing because whenever he attacks and... um. The player with the most life or tide, you can create one of those. If you are the one with the most life, uh, the opponent, you draw a card and you lose a life. One of those two is good. So if you're attacking and the opponent has it, you will create a vampire. Or if you if you had the most life or tide, then you will draw a card and lose a life. So that's very good. We're going to be gaining life anyway. Uh, how we gain life? Well, we got shielded. Every time we draw cards, we're going to gain life. We also have da, 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 a virtue. Yes, we'll gain life. So we'll destroy something and we will gain life. So the life losing here is not going to be crazy. And then after that, we're just going to be preaching with this card. I like it a lot, guys. It's a 2-4-4-3. Four, four, uh, what else we got? We got two cat downs. We're just going to destroy stuff. We got greedy uh, free booter. This guy is really good just because we can just sacrifice him, right? We can just block things like that and sacrifice it. And it works really good with the Spiteful because we can drop this turn one, turn two Spiteful, and then we already have a three two because we'll give a one one to this one. Very nice. We also have things to sacrifice. Um, and if we do sacrifice things, we'll be souls of the lost. We can just sacrifice one of these guys or we can just sacrifice the token enchantment and we already have a three two on turn two. Which is very nice. Uh, we have two bitter triumph. This right here. Yes, we can discard a card or pay three life. Doesn't matter. But we will destroy target creature or planeswalker, which is really good. So having this three removals here helps a lot. Go for the throat. There is not a lot of things that are artifacts lately, so we can just destroy things. Uh, Pilfer. We got to see what the opponent has in the hand, so we can just discard that. Um, a skull cap snail. My goodness, guys, this card right here. The opponent will have to exile a card from the hand. Uh, yeah, we cannot see it, but they will have to choose. And if we make them discard already, then they will have to, you know, exile it. Uh, souls of the lost. I like it a lot because this thing can become a two four. I'm sorry, a two three, a four or oh, three four, things like that. So this thing becomes very, very big depending on how many cards you got in the graveyard uh virus beetle just to make the opponent discard i know we can add liliana but i'm trying to play cards that not everybody's playing out there so i wanna i wanna mix things up uh we got two preachers two shielders because i mean if you do not pull shielders in a mono black i don't know what you're doing starving revenant whenever it comes to the battlefield surveil two and for each card you put on top of your library uh you draw two cards and you lose three um three life so if you put two in the graveyard you don't lose anything but if you put one to your hand then you lose three life uh descend an eight whenever you draw a card if there are eight or more permanents card in your graveyard target opponent loses one life and you gain one life i mean if we do that yeah we can get it but you know it, it's all good descend an eight is nice this thing right here that's what i wanted to play aclasot's deepest betrayal it's a flying with lifelink. Whenever attacks, each opponent discards a card. For each opponent who can, you draw a card. We're drawing cards. That's what we want. And if we have shielder in the battlefield, then we're gaining life. So all the life, all the life that we have lost, we get it back. And this thing has lifelink as well. Uh, so if opponent cannot discard, you create a one-one token with flying. And whenever this thing dies, bring it back to the battlefield tapped. And if you do, you can just pay three, transform it. Uh, oh, blah, blah, blah. And you can just transform it bring it back yes you do yes you bring it back yes uh i've never i've never transformed it back so that's that's what i'm just saying anyways and then we have virtue with is three virtues and you guys know what the virtue does bunch of lands we also have the hidden uh necropolis 
we can discover four a bunch of swamps stacking numa just to bring whatever we have on the graveyard to the battlefield and we'll be bringing back things with the virtue which is very nice as well and mishra and mirax just because we always have to have those cards uh on the lands we got 24 and that's it guys so let's see where this is gonna take us in the ladder i mean We'll keep the hand. Definitely. Definitely. Man, it sucks that I cannot play the way I used to play. But anyways. We will be doing some stuff over here. I've enjoyed some of the cards. Uh, yeah, yeah. And we get preacher later. We'll go here and then preacher. Or souls. We can go souls and then just discard that. Do more damage. That's what I like doing in souls and having the spiteful hex makes. Hex. <laughs> hex mage. Alright. Let's go see. See what you got in your hand. Probably gonna make a counter. Gotta see what he's got left. That way we can just do souls the turn after. There we go. Know what I'm saying? I still have more counters in there. Of course. Bunch of counters, bro. Whichever you want to... Man, I'm telling you. Mono Blue has been annoying for the past... Year and a half. It's you exile. An island? Okay. Okay. Now you got three cards in your hand, which... I think I will go with the Preacher. That sucks. But we're still gonna go with you. It sucks that we did not have a removal right there. But at least we got she older band. She older down. Okay. We'll do I think we'll do souls. No, we'll just do preacher. We'll do preacher. Definitely doing preacher. Let me see. Does not have counters. Okay. Does not have a single counter. And we can just do Aklasa the turn after. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Um, let's go ahead and go like this. Let's see if you want to trade that. Oh, you do trade it. Okay. I was gonna say you Okay. I was gonna say, okay. You wanna trade that, my friend? There's nothing he can do now. There is definitely nothing you can do right now, my friend. There's nothing you can do. Okay. That's not enough. You attack with everything, we win. And we got shield red. You still attack with everything. 
Alright, so. It would let him die. Uh, let's block over here. We'll take three. Um, let's attack just with you. Okay. There's into life. See if you want to attack next turn, my friend. Let's see if you want to attack next turn. Hmm. Hmm. Bring it, son. Bring it. Yes, you are bringing it. That's it. I don't know what I don't know what you wanted to attack. I don't know what you wanted to attack. That's what you get, my friend. Oh my god, we're back on gold. Okay, I still like it. We'll keep this hand. Mr. Dr. Swayze. Swayze or Swayze. Mm, mono red, you guys know that's not good. You guys know that. Okay. We take the damage. Yeah, let's just cry. Let's see what we get. Another one. Yes, no. Yes, no, maybe. Yeah, why not? It's fine. We can do both. Just discard. Kill both of the annoying things right there. Kumano. Okay. All right, so first of all, we will lock. Did we pay the three life? I just don't want to discard stuff. Mm. I spade the three life. I really don't want to discard stuff, so we'll do it like that. We can discard one and then just wait for this. Feel a ruin? It's okay. We still have cat down. I mean, this is always what's gonna happen when we play against a mono red. Always. You guys know that. Seems like he does not have a land, which is good for us. Hopefully, we get another land. All right. Let's get rid of you. That way, our soul can come back. Because it's going to be in the graveyard. We get the land. Uh... That's fine. We're just gonna discard a card after. He will have to have two shocks. If he attacks, I mean he has another um, removal.
How many we got? We got four. All right, we'll take two damage. We'll take the two damage. Okay, we knew. You don't have two. You do not have two rage. Mr. Opponent, I know you do not have to rage. I mean, sometimes, you know, what's that? that's what happens. Mono Red has two. They got everything in hand. I don't think he has it this time. Oh, he does. Jesus Christ. All right. Just gonna have to go like this. Sacrifice that. And we'll wait. We will wait. Okay. Are you gonna attack with both? Of course you won't. Go for a throw, that's nice. He does not have the land, man, that sucks. He can't attack now. And I think he wasted this rage right there. Alright, let's get rid of you. Still don't get a land, but we'll do this. Uh, should I attack? No. We'll attack with the Preacher later. Come on, man. You do not have anything crazy now. Mr. Opponent. Squee. All right, attack with everything. It's fine with me. You didn't. But let's make sure you get rid of stuff now. Whatever you got, make sure you do not have it anymore. We need another land. I'll attack with you. Let's see if you want to trade something. I don't think you would. You do! You're insane! <sighs> Opponent! What are we doing over here? We're about to get eight. Okay. I don't think he will get anything crazy. Mm. Still go ahead and do it like this. We need to get the life. We need to gain the life. We get the land, man. Just need to have one land. Okay. Jesus, man. We'll go something like this now. Yep. Gotta start putting some pressure now. Mm. 
And then if something, we can just start attacking the next turn. He has a land that doesn't help him. We'll attack with everything the turn after. Yeah, I don't think Squeeze is going to save you. I don't think Squeeze is going to save you, man. We won with three lands. That is insane. But Mono Red beats Mono... Mono... Blah, mono Black meets Mono Red. All right. Not bad. We'll keep it. Because later on, we can start just sacrificing stuff. Angels. Okay. I'll give you some angels later. All right. Let's see what kind of angels you got in your hand. Um. I don't like resplendent angel. This one doesn't really matter. Resplendent Angel is just too crazy. Resplendent Angel is just too crazy. Get rid of you. If he brings the vampire, man, we're we're losing it. No. Okay. We'll take the three damage. That's all right. But we're gonna be bringing now the starving. Or uh, we can just wait because this thing is gonna start becoming crazy too. We don't kill it now. How, how can he gain life? Bring in one of this. So let's get rid of you. Okay. Dana Klasad, we can just bring it now. We'll be good. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna be good now. Um, should we just should we do it? Or we just leave this guy. We can make him discard two cards. Let's go ahead. Go ahead and do it. Don't have anything crazy. I know you don't. No, you don't. Yes, you do. Okay. We can do starving. We'll do starving. We gotta do starving now. Let's go Preacher. Go like this. It's fine. Oh, we actually needed a land. Alright, so we're taking five.
We played it wrong, man. We played it wrong. All right, man. We played that really, really bad. Really bad. But there was no removal. If we would have at least one of those two, probably could have done something better. Um, let's kill it. Let's kill it right away. Let's kill it right away. Uh, we can discard it and just take a life. That's not a problem. Okay. That's fine. So this one is whenever attacks with the most or tied. Most or tie. Okay, what did you exile? River it all guide. Alright. Bring it on. Do all you gotta do. Obviously, you're gonna do that. We'll make you pay... Th well, we'll pay three life. We're definitely gonna pay three life. Uh, pay three life. Kill you. What does this thing do? Whenever something blah 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 for you look at the top four cards, okay? I don't think that's very uh then got us right now. Creature is just too good, man. Oh look at this. Come on, man. Come on. Tell me about having everything we got. Tell me about having everything in our hands. See what I'm saying? We we could have had something like that against... That day we could have done a lot of things. Could have done a lot of things. But Angels has always been crazy. And they just added it really, really... They just made it really strong. Okay. Should we... Should we trade? One, two, three, four, five, six. We can trade. We can trade. It's all good. It's all good, guys. Man, he just had all the cards that he didn't... You're exploring like crazy. Mr. Federico. You have a Vian Rico. I don't think that's enough, though. Three, four, five, six. We got another lamp. Okay. Go for the throat. Um, yeah. Yes. 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 Yes, we'll take that too. Um, let's see what happens. And nothing happens because Mr. Opponent just says no. I'm telling you guys. I'm telling you, look at Mono Black doing Mono Black stuff. All right, all right, all right. I like it. I do like it. Double Ganker. All right. Well, um, yes. Let's push him to make the guy bigger. Never mind. What are you doing?
Alright, let's kill that thing now. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, we'll go like this. We'll just attack. Because we are waiting. We we are waiting. She Aldred. That's a scary. That is a very scary card. But we have the answer. We get the answers. Double virtue. Unless you have another one. That would be crazy as well. Um. Yeah, I think we're going to have to drop the Revenant. Thanks. We'll be playing the beer chew very soon. I'll take the land. He has a beer chew as well, man. Um... You know what? Four. You got four, five. Let's do it like this. We'll just do it like that. One, two, three, four, five. Six. He's wanting to dig to get that beard too. But if we play ours, we can bring his own shield faster. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. We'll bring Shielder faster than him. It's all good. It's all good. We finally got a good match over here. I mean, Golgari is always going strong now. Oh, look at that. Well, look, well just look at this. Would you look at that? And we got to go for the throw, which is good. We ain't attacking. Oh, you want me to um, discard? Okay. <laughs> we all have things we'd rather forget. I'll discard something. I will discard something. You have another Liliana. Alright, so we'll be bringing Shield Red. Told you. I <laughs> told you. I mean, that was gonna be just destruction right there, man. Like, nothing could have saved him. Nothing. Hey guys, we are back to the wrap up. And very, very nice streak that we have with this deck. Uh, Angels got us a little crazy. I played the Revenant very, very bad. But I don't think we had any way to come back. Uh, besides that, the deck was really, really nice. I know I have made a lot of mistakes today, even talking. Just because I'm a little tired and I haven't recorded anything for the past week. And like, you know, guys, it gets lost. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video just like I did. And whatever you are in the world, have a nice day, morning or evening. And I will see you in the next video. Where is the kingdom? You guys are awesome. Bye bye.